Every day with Jesus is sweeter than the day before. That's the testimony of a Christian who is living the balanced, victorious Christian life. If we're just up and down and hot and cold, we can't say every day is sweeter than the day before. Now, our focus is not upon the difficulties of life, but our focus is upon the one who is the answer, Jesus Christ, the one who knows how to navigate those stormy waters to bring us through and improve us and make us more uh, like He is. Why, Jesus Christ is the one that we need to keep our focus upon. In the Song of Solomon, we see so many descriptions of Jesus Christ there. In verse number 16 of chapter number 5 of Song of Solomon, His mouth is most sweet. Yea, he is altogether lovely. This is my beloved, and this is my friend, O daughters of Jerusalem. Every individual who comes to God through Christ will discover sooner or later the sweetness of that Savior. It says, first of all, his mouth is most sweet. His mouth. What he says is is the source of peace, the source of confidence, the source of joy. I need to be in the Word of God. It speaks of a Christian who, instead of, of suffering apart from the Word of God, gets into the Word of God and gains, by faith, a foothold that will enable him to move forward, keep on going forward and not stop. And then he is altogether lovely. There is no, there is no judgment, there is no... Uh, aspect of the Lord Jesus Christ and His will for my life that is not lovely. Now, there may, may be times when it seems as though it's a little rough, it's a little difficult, but He's working all things together for my good, Romans 8, 28. And this is my beloved. Now, He did what He did for us because He wants us to voluntarily love Him. And so we have the privilege as, um, as human beings to love the Lord Jesus Christ from our heart. We need to do that. We need to tell him that we love him. We need to show him. And this is my friend. There's not a friend like the lowly Jesus. No, not one. No, not one. So you've got easily provided in that very verse. All of you preachers out there, all of you Sunday school teachers, the Holy Spirit has given us a four point outline. He is all of those things. He's got that sweet, sweet mouth, that word that comes to, to meet our need. He's altogether lovely. There are no mistakes. There are no letdowns with Him. He is to be loved. We need to tell Him and show Him. And He is our friend and He'll stick closer, closer than a brother. Father, we thank You for Jesus Christ. And we cannot begin to describe how wonderful He is. But we thank and praise You, Lord, for Jesus Christ who makes all the difference. With heads bowed and eyes closed, if you've never received Christ as your Savior, then right now, for whosoever shall call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. Would you pray right now from your heart to God? Something like this. Dear God, I need a Savior. Right now I receive Christ as my personal Savior. I believe that He's coming into my life and saving me. Take away my sins and take me to heaven when I die. And if you prayed that prayer, let us know. We'd love to rejoice with you. And all the soul winners out there, let us know how the Lord is blessing in that regard. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for that one on a bed of affliction right now who's looking up and sees the Savior. I'm thinking of the one right now who's alone and, and feeling lonely. May he or she look up and see Jesus Christ, the altogether lovely one. Thank you for the Word of God. Thank you for the fact that there are no mistakes with Jesus Christ in our life and in our course of living. I pray, Lord, that you'll help us now to yield and to submit to you. And Lord, we love you. Thank you for, for the salvation that's freely given through Calvary and the empty tomb. Thank you so much for the blessing every day, the fulfillment that we experience in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes. Every day with Jesus is sweeter than the day before. God bless you as you live for Him today. You are listening to From the Shepherd to the Sheep Daily Devotionals. This is a ministry of Central Baptist Church in Woodbridge, Virginia. If you would like to learn more about our ministries, you can find us online at cbcwoodbridge.org. 
You will also find many other helpful resources there, including preaching, devotionals, and songs. We thank you for listening to this devotional from the Shepherd to the Sheep.